All right, so as you can see, I'm applying the oat cream, homemade oat oh, hope cream that is. You know, there's something beautiful about using um, nutrition, food for, for use of our hair and our skin. You know, we always concentrate on eating organic, healthy foods, uh, consuming for the body, but uh, it's always important also to apply these things that we can actually eat, that we can recognize as food externally. And so I see a lot of benefits uh, to that, um, not just hair care, but you know, you making home like do-yourself uh, creams for the skin, the face, even to clean the house, um, you know, natural things, natural as possible. We want to be as close to Eden as possible because God desires to restore his children to his image, not just... Um, in terms of physicality, mentally, emotionally, but especially spiritually. Now, if you're whether you're white, whether you're black, whether you're Indian, Asian, Arab, you're, and you're viewing this, embrace embrace your natural beauty. Whether you have straight hair naturally, or whether you have curly hair, whether you have brown skin, whether you're fair skinned, just know that you're not a mistake. God intentionally created you the way he intended it. And what I really love uh, is this passage that spoke to my heart personally, found in the Psalms 139, verse 14, and actually 13 and 14, where it says, For you form my inward parts, you covered me in my mother's womb. I will praise you, for I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Marvelous are your works, and that my soul knows very well. I can testify to that. He is marvelous and he is the greatest architect and artist of all time. And you know, there's beauty and diversity. Would it be really boring if God were to create everyone with the same skin tone, same hair texture, same everything? It'd be quite boring. You know, so just know that you are loved, you are created in his image, embrace who you are, and be content, you know? All right, so as you can see here, I applied the oat cream all over the hair, and I just have it back here. I like my hair pretty simple. I love simplicity. Um, so it just gives you an idea what it would look like. Uh, uh, of course, I'm not an expert here, but everyone has different hair textures. It may look different, but that's how mine's turned out. Also, when you think of creation, it ties well for the, with the Sabbath because when God created everything, it says in scriptures, it was good. So on that note, Happy Sabbath! Alright, so that was a short demo of me applying the oat cream, homemade ho oat cream. I will post the link below of where I got the recipe. Easy to do, you could do it yourself. And I also made the homemade flaxseed gel as well. Um, so these are amazing ways you could nourish your hair along with other, you know, food items that are rich in beta carotene, vitamin C and all those things. Uh, which can help fortify your hair, along with good nutrition, exercise, and 
all the rest of the eight laws of health. All right, so that's about it. God bless and see you next time. Bye. Get right with God. His pardon is free. Get right with God. He's waiting for thee. Our Jesus is calling. Oh, come unto me. Take him, O sinner.